Welcome to this Faster Pro tutorial. In this tutorial we're going to show you just how easy it is to export Faster Pro tree models to virtually any 3D editing software. Uh, in this case we're going to use Blender. So let's select a new tree model and this is the Forester Light Maple Tree which is one of the free models that comes with the unregistered version of the program. So it's very easy in Forrester Pro to get exactly the model we want. Uh, on this one we'll, we'll reposition the leaves on the tree randomly until we get something that we like. So I quite like this model. And we'll export this by going to File, Export. So here's the Export menu. There's lots of different options on here. You can see we've, we've checked the high resolution model. We could automatically generate LODs as well. I'll include a collision mesh so you can see what the collision mesh looks like. And because we're going to export this for Blender, just for now we'll, we'll use the export double-sided leaf meshes. So this will generate two faces on the leaf meshes. And I click Export, add a new directory, and press OK. And now our tree model has been exported. So let's open up Blender, and we'll import that model. So we go to File, to Import, and Collada. And now we can select the file that we've just exported. So here's the Collider file, and we press Import, and there's our tree model. Now the first thing you'll notice is you can see the collision mesh. Now this collision mesh is used by many 3D applications to calculate collisions with things like the player or vehicles. We'll do fast bullet calculations. So we can hide it in the Objects Inspector. We find that node that the the collision mesh is attached to and we can hide that that mesh so we can see the actual tree model. Um, let's hide the leaf meshes so we can see the structure of the branches um, and I think those stru that structure is rather nice for that, that that maple tree and you can see that they're all a single object. Had we selected independent objects within the Forrester Pro export menu then they would be independent objects attached to their own nodes and we could edit them independently. So you can see that the leaf textures show no transparency in Blender. This is simply because in Blender we need to set the material properties to show that transparency. Most other 3D editing software works slightly different and it will appear automatically. We can now take our tree model and export it from Blender or from whatever editing software we use to the, exactly the format that we need for our end product 3D application. So we hope that you can see that it's really easy to export Forrester Pro tree models into whatever format that you need for your 3D application. You can download Forrester Pro right now from our website. There is an unregistered version that produces an unlimited number of random trees of seven different types. Anyway, we hope you find Forrester Pro useful and you make some really good games and mods using the models that you make with our software.